Before we start, I would like to ask everyone to please turn your cell phones off. Now, welcome everyone to the Round Square Regional Conference of the Americas. Belgrano Day School is proud to have you here in Buenos Aires and of being your host during the next seven days. We've been waiting for this day for a long time. I have been working to make it the best week possible. We trust this will be an opportunity for true encountering, making new friends, discovering new cultures, and getting a deeper understanding of Round Square ideals, especially those of leadership, adventure, and service. We are honored today to have with us the representatives of Canada, Colombia, and Peru. His Excellence, Mr. Robert Fry, Canadian Ambassador, Mrs. Marie-Hélène Jacques, Commercial Secretary of the Canadian Embassy, Mr. Lenin Hernández Alarcón, Ministro Consejero representing the Embassy of the Republic of Colombia, Mr. César Talavera Silva Santisteban, Consejero de la Embajada de la República del Perú. Presenting at the ceremony are Mr. Francisco Lehmann, Deputy General Director, Mr. Diego Cotroba, Headmaster of Midland Senior School. Other BDS authorities present are Andrea Pelicchia, Primary Headmistress, and Maria Lucerini, Kindergarten Headmistress. We would like to warmly welcome each delegation and their students and parents of our community. Please stand as we welcome the national flags of the countries attending this conference. Argentina, Canada, Colombia, Peru, United States of America, and Bermuda. standing as we sing our national anthem. Playing the piano is teacher Magdalena Reuter and in the guiding voices are our students Macarena Paulos and Nicole Cohen. Thank you. 
I would like to invite Mr. Francisco Lehmann, Deputy General Director of BDS, to say a few words. Ladies and gentlemen, finally, the day, we are ready that date, right? Good afternoon, it's my pleasure to welcome you all to this Round Square Regional Conference. Please allow me in opening this conference to express to you, on behalf of the Grado Day School community and my own, our feelings of pride and honor for the opportunity to host this Round Square event. It is a pleasure to have you all here ready to enjoy this international experience. We wish you a pleasant stay among us and success in your activities during these next days. This conference brings together students and teachers from all around the region, from diverse countries and backgrounds to share their culture and experiences, exchange ideas and global best practices always around the round square ideals. Students, this whole experience was thought and planned for you. This is a school conference organized by students for students. During the next days, you will find the opportunity to share your time, work, and life with a lot of different people at home with guest families, during workshops, and cultural and service activities. So my advice would be be curious, ask, and learn and most important, connect with others. By connect, I mean not only share your time, but create real bonds. These bonds would be the very best asset you may take with you from this conference, and it's on you to seed and grow them. I think there is nothing better than this conference motto to summarize this advice. Embrace the opportunity. At this point, let me have a couple of words to thank families, BDS families, student teachers, and especially the conference project, the project team for the hard work to make this possible. There is a lot of effort and passion in every plan activity, and I'm sure that everyone will feel this as the scale goes on. So, welcome all. I really look forward to enjoying all together these next days at Begrano Day School and our city, Buenos Aires. I wish you the very best and embrace the opportunity. Thank you. Now I would like to invite Mr. Diego Gotroa, Headmaster of Midland Senior School, who will introduce each of the 24 schools attending this conference and their flags carried by a representative of each school. Good afternoon, let us welcome each of the flags with an applause. Appleby College. <laughs> Ashbury College. <laughs> the Athenian School without a flag. Bayview Glen Independent School. <laughs> Belgrano Day School. <laughs> Bermuda High School for Girls. Bishop's College School. Kate School. Chadwick School. Without a flag. Colegio Anglo Colombiano.
Colegio Los Nogales. Collingwood. Fountain Valley School of Colorado. Glen Lyon Norfolk School. Hackley School. The Hotchkiss School. Lakefield College School. Lower Canada College. Markham College. Palmer Trinity School. Providence Day School. Rothsey Neverwood School. St. Clement's School. And St. Mildred's Lightborn School. have chosen for this conference, Embrace the Opportunity, as our motto. So I would like to invite Pilar and Bruno, two of our student leaders, to explain why we chose it. Hello, everyone. Historically, Argentina was known as a land of opportunity for European immigrants who didn't have the resources, space, and reality to develop, to develop in their own country. Between constant European conflict, Argentina received thousands of ships carrying immigrants. We ourselves are descendants of these. When thinking of the word embrace, we all agree that a warm hug comes to our head. A helping hand always there for you. And this is what we wanted to be able to reflect all over the logo that will represent the conference. Thinking of Argentine culture, we brought in La Cueva de las Manos, a famous cave in the province of Santa Cruz in our country. This cave is filled with paintings of hands, which are over 9,000 years old. It is a millenary cave that is part of the world's heritage, adding internationalism to our logo. With this idea in mind, we decided to dig deeper with the cooperation subjects, which we had agreed our logo needed, thus the hands. We made them daring enough to break the circle which reflected that any hand can chase and embrace any kind of opportunity and be stronger than it ever was by receiving help from others, just like all of the Round Square delegates. Thank you. I would now like to invite our student leader team to step up so that everyone can meet them. Azul and Clara, two of our senior students, who are also leaders, will be coming forward to introduce them. Hi everyone, we are Clara and Azul, and we are present on behalf of the whole team of student leaders. We have been working hard on this conference since last year to make sure that you will have a great experience and return home with many memorable moments to share. 
On these days, we are looking forward to show you our culture through the different workshops, our city through a photo safari, and invite you to taste our famous barbecue known here as Asado. We will explore together a totally new experience for us too, the building of houses for people living in underprivileged neighborhoods. Are you nervous for meeting your host family? Well, you will be glad to hear that they are waiting and have been preparing their houses for you anxiously. Now we would like you to introduce your different barazas, which are the discussion groups in which you will be assigned to participate throughout the conference. These are named after different districts in Buenos Aires. Baraza number one, Recoleta. Number two, Olivos. Number three, Avellaneda. Number four, Palermo. Number five, San Isidro. Number six, La Boca. And finally, Boedo. Once again, we all hope you have a wonderful time. Welcome, Welcome to Round Square Regional Conference 2017. Our preschool students would like to share their joy of having you here, so they are do it in their very own special way. one of our senior students will read a brief introduction to Tango Negro. In this opportunity, we will be presenting an arrangement by our music teachers, Alejandro Fernandez, BDS Orchestra Conductor, Juan Staforini, BDS Choir Conductor, and Pablo Favazza, Director of the Percussion Ensemble. The conquest and colonization did not only transform once and for all the existence of native peoples, but also entailed the arrival of African men and women to be used as slaves for the development of conquistadores' plans for the new territories. Studies have shown that 30% of the white population of America has at least one color ancestor. The music and dance forms, which make up the artistic heritage of Latin America, represent its great cultural diversity and are a link to each individual's history and traditions. They embody the symbolic significance of culture and identity and are instrumental in promoting respect for cultural diversity and fostering communication among civilizations and cultures. In Latin America, countries have combined their traditions, thus creating hybrid cultures which are rich in folklore, art, and knowledge. The hybrid cultures of Latin America integrated a new and complex way, tradition, regional, national, cultured, and popular elements. 
hybridization questions the existence of pure or genuine cultures. Argentina has inherited a wide range of elements from its African immigrants and their descendants. This rich legacy emerges in the melodies of different musical genres. Despite the eventual dwindling of the African Argentine population, many manifestations of their culture have remained and are now part of our most distinguished traditions. Perhaps the most enduring legacy of black influence in Argentina is tango, which appeared in festivals and ceremonies carried out by the slaves at the tangos, houses which were used as meeting places. Candome, milonga, malambo, chacarera, and pachada also developed under African influence. Dance is probably the greatest contribution in Africans to Latin America's cultural heritage. We are all mestizos. Tango negro, tango negro, te fuiste sin avisar Los gringos fueron cambiando tu manera de bailar Tango negro, tango negro, el amo se fue por mar Se acabaron los cantores en el barrio Mangas, cocos y minas repiten en el compás los toques de sus abuelos, borogotó, borogotó, chas, chas. Mangas, cocos y minas repiten en el compás los toques de sus abuelos, borogotó, borogotó, chas, chas.
closing this ceremony, we will listen to Mr. Stephen Page, former headmaster of middle and senior and overall academic coordinator of the school, who will say a few words. Can I leave this? Wow, thank you, Alejandro, Juan, Pablo, and Bibiana, for, 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 all for all the coordination, sorry. Um, bueno, my name is Stephen Page. I've been living in Argentina 30 years, which does not mean my Spanish is good by any means. What I want to ask the delegates is I remember, as if it was today, my first impressions when I entered Argentina in 1987. And I'd like you to share with me over the next few days what were your first impressions as you came along the motorway and into Belgrano. I'll share mine. But I want to hear yours as well. Welcome to the 98 delegates. Uh, many of you I met at the airport. All of you I know from your fun photographs. Uh, thank you very much for sending those. This has been a special year in all the preparation and certainly I'd like to thank the student leaders who come from quite a special year, our group of future school leavers year 2017. They've been trained for this event Light, like blind dogs, right? Uh, dogs for the blind. They know everything. Students, if you have a question, go to the student leaders. However, if they don't know the answer, and I'd like to invite Florencia to come up and Maura at this moment, if the student delegates don't know the answer, certainly Florencia and. Um, are you coming? We've been dancing for six months and. It's just part of the dance. I'm not going to ask you to dance with me, all right? But uh, most of the work has gone on from these two ladies. I just happen to be here at the microphone. So, ladies, have a great week as well and answer all those questions. When she doesn't know the answer, she'll come and ask me. But anyway, that's a different issue. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> if during the week there is ever a high-pitched whistle sound, it is the school's evacuation uh, alarm. And what you're going to have to do is just follow the kids from BDS. They know what to do. They know where to go. You will just have to follow them. All right? We're not going to do a fire drill during your time, but if there is a real evacuation, we need you to be aware and just follow those kids from, uh, from the senior school. Tomorrow starts at 8 o'clock. Punctually. You've been split into eight workshops, tageres, we call them in Argentina, workshops, dealing with different cultural activities in, from Argentina. Dance, you can't all learn tango, I'm sorry. Dance, folklore, music, singing, drums, handicraft, art, I think I've covered them all. It's an adventure. You don't have to be good at art. I'm not. You can achieve something. You can learn something about Argentine culture through that. You may have a horrible voice and think, why am I doing the singing? That's going to be the magic for uh, Juan to help you through that, to get something out of these workshops. So please enjoy the, um, the workshops. If you get homesick, Remember, your mum and dad are ten times missing you more than you're missing them, all right? Now, you call them and you say, Mum, oh, I'm really not feeling very well, the pillar's not right, or oh, whatever. Mum's going to go crazy. What's mum going to do? She's going to call your teacher. What's your teacher going to do? She's going to call me. I don't want that. She's going to call me. What am I going to do is call the host family. So if you've got a problem, just speak to the host family. Right? Cut the circle out. I would really appreciate that. And my last point is, I can't do anything about you being homesick. But I bought some things with me from home. I've got four boys. If you need one of these, this is a Moomin Troll from Finland. We have this. All right? By the way, one of my sons is over here. These are none of his. All right? He wouldn't let me bring his. We got a teddy bear. And although most of you said, I don't mind a house with a pet, but I don't want a snake, right? 
For those of you who would like to borrow one for the next few days, come and see me. You can borrow one. I've got lots at home. So have a wonderful week. Thank you. Now I would like to thank again our invited guest, His Excellency Mr. Robert Fry, Mrs. Marie-Hélène Jacques, Mr. Lenin Hernández Alarcón, and Mrs. Cesar Talavera Silva Santisteban for sharing this moment with us, and I hope some of the delegates will take the time to speak to you. I would also like to ask the delegates to please be patient while finding your bags and host families, since we know this process can get messy. Thank you everyone for coming, and let's have a wonderful week.